clean fight. Obey my commands and protect yourselves at all times. Touch gloves, good luck. Oh, uh, says he looks like an orange picker right. to one of the stalwarts of the heavyweight in the 2000s. Ideally, this won't require a lot of blow by blow. They're going to bang away. Yeah, I think so, it's going to be. I kind of doubt it. I think Vitaly's going to try to back away for the first. He landed a little left hook to begin the evening. Now he'll get inside Klitschko's arms. And what he's got to be careful is watching. Well, I would say this much at this at this point, Ariola has created a against the tally. Sam Peter didn't exist. Juan Carlos Gomez in his most recent fight with his great defense. And right now, Ariola has slowed down his momentum and his and his intensity has slowed to down. Discourage him from coming in. One minute and way minute. through. Our clock is momentarily not working, so I'll keep you posted Back on time. In position with the jab to get keep his distance. He finishes up everything with a long jab after he gets through. Ariola's gloves. This goal also holds his left hand well below his waist. His Why, left, Emmanuel? Left hand is right because he has an unusual sense. And he can sense it and move away. It's one of the unique things I watched when I was watching him in training. He can feel if you go to time to neutralize the punch. He takes great advantage of his height. It's been a Vitaly Klitschko round by and large up to now. Go, let go. The dominant action of the round has been won for one by Vitaly Klitschko. As is usually the case. One more. Hey, right, keep those hands up, baby. Just keep working behind that stick, all right? Let's go, guys. Let's go. Get the stool. Let's go. Rose is here to root for Ariola. He's buddies with promoter Dan Goosen and has been a guest in Ariola. Vitaly Klitschko, 34 out of 88. To only 7 of 32 for Chris Ariola. Sometimes the best way to deal with a jabber is to jab this round. But it, it, so far, Pisco has been keeping the fight. He cannot right. really get the range for his punches yet. Right now. easier for Chris to go to the body. And there he stays right now. He's comfortable to stay. But I will say, Greg, Chris, as we see right there, is creating a lot more anxiety than anyone else has done. Knocking Ariola back a step. There's a body shot for Klitschko. He ain't pretty. making Klitschko work hard. Yeah, that's right. I mean, the reason Vitaly threw 88 punches in round one to keep him back. That's how eager Ariola is to get there. This is it. Where he can just simply move back right, right, and then reach in and punch. Two good shots. Yes, he has his own effective awkwardness, but it's very, very good. Very coordinated awkwardness. German interpreter Rudy Kuntz. Keep those hands, hands moving, hands up, all right? Let's go, guys, let's go, let's go. Keep up the pace. He's fighting with an open mouth, breathing through his mouth. My memory is... Long distance fights still doing that all night because he maintains that certain space where he can get away with that. And it's... And all of the punches... Which angle they're coming from? Well, the other thing is that he can throw arm punches with... If you're an Ariel given for treating yourself to the notion that he's getting closer and maybe doing a smile smiling. on Chris's face there after he ducked a punch from Vitaly. Well, the question becomes who's paid more of a price to get through the first three rounds? Is Klitschko wearing down from all the movement and activity? Um, how long can he go on taking this kind of punishment? Klitschko is, with his PhD in sports science, a cold counter. Pick it up. Right? Deep breath. Don't get careless, right? I need, I need to be aggressive or smart. Right? And creating a lot of more pressure on Vitaly than anyone that he's fought in a long time. Vitaly Klitschko. Jim, I gotta tell you, Chris Ariola is making the biggest mistake I've ever seen. You gotta give him angles and you gotta work your way inside by giving him angles. Just like he's doing there. Make, 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 While make you were talking, he, he landed, did Ariola, his two most effective punches of the fight so far. One was a right 
Harold, you want him to be another fighter. He's this fighter. This is a long way to go. I would have to say that Ariel is taking that distance away from him and he's having his hands. Only fight in the best fight that he can fight. And this may be changing the fight. Certainly he needs to get his supporters in the crowd into it here in this fourth round. Yeah, Metallic, because Metallic can get tired, but when you have experience, it's like a, a set very easy. Well, Klitschko, he's so tall and he fights. It was Ariola who promised us punches in bunches. He hasn't been able to get there enough. Look for him underneath a little more, oh, all right? Okay. Oh, oh, I'm sorry. sorry. Talk to you, have a little loop room in his punches. And you see a little short left hook right here to land the barrier is simply because he's closer to gap and getting closer where Vitaly has pressure in Klitschko, get closer, and cause Vitaly to make a mistake. And in the fifth, another right hand. Lands a body shot. Feet to turn back with the right hand. Ariola got to be very careful. He didn't get too anxious and get too careless because he sees Vitaly win. Vitaly can punch from a distance where he can punch at. He can hit just like that. Manages to corner Vitaly Klitschko. Punches to the body. Power punches. They should. You know they're in amateur boxing, but I think you should in professional boxing. There was a moment in the fourth round when it appeared Klitschko might be tiring a little. I'm hurting anywhere now. Well, and he knows that Vitaly is not a big one punch punch. Thank you. Good job. Go to the left and then retaliate. Right, step out. Okay, first left, then right. Why don't you keep doing what you're doing? Cutting him off to the left, all right? And then we'll see what happens after that. And then he goes hands up. Ariola almost walked into a big right hand. He's got to be there. He said he had a plan A, a plan B, and a plan C for this fight. Ariola's still trying. Both Samuel Peter. and Juan Carlos Gomez, Klitschko's last two opponents, had basically given up. A long time, and it's certainly not to be that. Even though he's winning it, he's really having to work. Well, after every exchange yeah. and, and clinching. In fact, how many clinches have you saw in this entire fight? That Ariola's momentum is waning. And now he almost got a big right hand on to the cheek. Okay. You land between punch and Vitaly. Well, you know, we've, we've talked about Ariola, but it's really hard to hit Klitschko with the second shot or hits you to keep the space. He's fighting a very controlled distance fight. Any of the last several opponents who just couldn't get inside on the big right. man. We're halfway through Thank the you. scheduled 12 rounds. I get it. One more. Open your mouth, Dick. Open your mouth. He's winning this, this fight on clean punching, as we see. Nice left jab. Good right hand fist. I mean, he should want Vitaly for holding because Chris needs that, you know, him up that, real quick. So watch for that. Six to nothing, Klitschko. Actually, Vitaly's been so effective with his punches so far, Harold, that he's held well, He's had side to side-to-side movement that's kept. Brother Vladimir is in Vitaly's corner as well, as no doubt you've seen. Let's put it this way. You can't resist speculating on what would happen if the two brothers got into the ring with each other. Good body shot by Vitaly Klitschko. It's amazing I can return a punch back. And that's again, Emmanuel, because most of them... And also because he is so adept at managing space Stop. in the ring. Supreme conditioning, supremely important to a younger athlete. Look at this. Buddy. The Klitschkos, both of whom weigh about 235, 240, because they come to camp in such magnificent shape that all they do is add muscle. Okay, try to go Which is typical of the town of punches he's landing as Ariel is trying to come in, catch him with clean shots, and then after he lands those shots, he uses move.
That's good for the moment. Control of the face jump. And, you know, he's, he's keeping it at a And Mariola. Maybe that's to jump soon. in and make it mean something. Mariola's just never stopped trying. Succeeded in tiring Big Vitale out. That was part of the plan as articulated to us. I was about to say 40 seconds ago that Vitale seemed to be trying to take a rest in this round. I think but it's Ariola also, sent Yeah, Ariola put a lot, and now he's creating the... He's creating a lot of fun. He's he's expected over. things happen here than anywhere else. It's the only game you can... Blood coming now from the nostrils. Chris Ariola. Stop, stop. Blood in the mouth. Tripling down the rippling stomach. I got you, I got you, I got you. Wait, stop. Time, time, time. Okay, mira, mira. Keep doing what you're doing, okay? I want you to look for that right hand, but you gotta... Okay, Brooks. Chris Ariola is 28 and still learning. He throws yeah. The town is experiencing. It's really sure he's okay. better to think and function better because of having been there before. He's closing in on the KO. Yeah, yes, he's landing more. Even though Ariola's creating the excitement. What? I got you, I got you, I got you. Can't stop the right hand. The left hook as Ariola leaned in. How about that right uppercut? The right uppercut is as good as physically. And Ariola can't function as good. Left jab and the straight right hand, and the right hand underneath the top. The ability to think is a big thing down now. There was a moment in the eighth round when Ariola may have thought that it was at that moment. Ariola is still trying. Perfect tactical fight. And again, credit to Ariola. He's pressured Vitali all the way. And made him. It's going wonderful. I think the referee is stopping the fight. Either the referee or Henry Ramirez. And I, and I believe it might have been Henry Ramirez who simply didn't want to see his fighter go out and get battered around. I think again. it was a good call. Anyway, anyway, he could turn this around with a sudden shot. Vitali Klitschko!